Hey guys, it's me, AJ Alexandra. So I just got back from the Dollar Tree and I found some really, really great stuff. And I had to make a video so I can show you what I found. And just in case you're heading out this week to Dollar Tree, here's some things you might want to keep an eye out for. So stay tuned while I show you all the goods that I found. And with Easter being just around the corner, I feel like it's the perfect time to stock up on like all your cooking supplies and just different things like that. And I found these awesome trays. They have the lid already with it and the pan right here. So if you're taking treats to your children's school or just dropping off something to the community center or just even if you're cooking at home with loved ones, this makes life so much easier because you literally just bake right in this dish and then put the top on it. So I stocked up on these, you guys. Like I literally, I think I bought nine of them. <laughs> so they had it in pink too. Socks right here. They're the women's fashion knee-high socks. Oh my god, I love these. Especially for like when you're working out, different things. This tall knee-length sock. And it has that cute little stripe right there. Some printer paper. But this has the cute ice cream cones on it. So I love these. And this has um, 40 sheets in it. So that's really good. I found a rose gold cell phone case. And it's I haven't been able to find one for the 6 Plus at um, Dollar Tree. So I finally found it. And what I'm going to do is probably do a DIY with these, but I just grabbed it because it's rose gold. I love rose gold and it's plain, so I can kind of do my own thing with it. Next, I found the dough modeling clay, but this is the pastel colors, and there's four in there. You have like the lavender, the teal, the yellow, and the white. Then I found these cute boxes. It's the gold foil polka dots on it with the white and then pink. They also had this cute little stripe one. This just reminds me of like a candy store or something like, um, I don't know. It just has like a really cute little look to it. So there's that one. And it has like that recycled paper look on top with the brown. Summer is just around the corner too and spring is right here upon us. And so we're getting ready for ice cream <laughs> season, of course, or at my house. And look at these ice cream slider spoons. So they have the refill packs of the crystal beads that you put like for your air freshener. This one's in um, waterfall scent. And then here's the container. So I guess after this is all dry and done, just go ahead and refill it back with these. And um, there's six, 10 ounces, 10.6 ounces in this one. And then this one has 8 ounces. I grabbed one of these just because I feel like this kind of stuff makes bath time fun for the little ones. And this is like, like a shark, I guess. So that one was really cute. I also found these play foam mats. I really thought I was done with all the new pictures that <laughs> Dollar Tree has. But of course, I found two more that I had to have today. So I grabbed those. This really beautiful peacock. And I thought this one was really cool. It says, life is a grand adventure, go live it. I found this new washi tape for me. I hadn't seen this print before. It's like that um, pink and black leopard. There's a nail art pin. And then going back to the getting ready for Easter baskets, I found some wood shop sailboats. I have little builders in my family, so they love this kind of stuff where they just get hands-on and just build little creations. They also had the um, airplane. I also picked up two of the helicopters. Another nail polish, uh, nail polish set. It's like a orange color and purple, and they say they glow in the dark, so. <laughs> I guess I'll find out eventually if they actually do really glow in the dark. But these really cool signs. So I love like different little sayings and like of course wall art. So I found one that said smile. And it's wood. Another one that says you were born to sparkle. I love this one. And then this one says easy peasy lemon squeezy and I just love the colors on this one so this will go perfect in my little office area. I'm having a lot of fun with the Dollar Tree socks like you go through socks so much so it's like you don't always have to spend a fortune on them when you do find them. So here's some polka dot ones for the little ones and then the fish. 
This set is for me. It has the three packs. So rainbows. This is just a plain one with teal. And then this stripe one here. And then this one, it says treat yourself. And then that almost looks like a donut. I got one more nail polish. This is like a mint green color. This one is by LA Colors. The cooling racks. I've never seen these at Dollar Tree before and it's a two pack in these. So I'm going to try these out and I'll let you guys know if they're actually any good, like if they're pretty sturdy. I ran across some really cool books that I was happy to get my hands on. So the first one is The Veducation of Robin. It's all type of like vegetable recipes on this one. And this book right here, hopefully you can see it, it says it was $35. But I got this one from Dollar Tree. Can't wait to try out some recipes in there. Jenny Rivera story. I couldn't believe they had this at Dollar Tree. So, I grabbed that one. Ghana Must Go. And then Death of a King. The real story of Martin Luther King Jr.'s final year. And it's by Tavis Smiley. So that should be an interesting read as well. I also ran across this hat right here from Dollar Tree. I really like the material. It, it feels real breathable. So it, like when you're working out or just like in the heat, I feel like this will feel really good on your head. Another book. This one says um, Amigas and School Scandals. <laughs> so that one should be a juicy read, right? Here's some little stationery supplies. I thought these were really cute. And you can find stuff like this at Target, like in their little bullseye playground for like $3. So it was pretty neat to find them for a dollar. I thought they were really cute. I don't know. It's like a floral and then polka dot print. I had to get these shimmer tattoos that I seen on TV. And then I just found a couple gift bags that I thought were really cute. So here's the Easter one with the... Um, little bunny rabbits on it. This one is like the vintage Victorian era style stuff on it. The telephone, typewriter, the, tri the bike, the chair. So really cute stuff on there. I love the colors on that also. And then here's just a birthday wishes bag with the foil on it. I also found these Sweet Shop sticker sets. So I guess you kind of like design your own sweet shop and then just put the stickers wherever. Of course, I'll probably just use these stickers for something else, but I feel like you get so much in this pack and the little kid is cute, so I might as well just pick through it and see what I like. They have these cute little um, cookie cutters, like wedding day. Well, not even wedding day, but it says lady cookie cutters. So let's check them out. This one is a high heel. This one is a dress. I was really surprised to see these at Dollar Tree. I know usually they have like the rubbery plastic ones, but I've never seen the metal ones. And then here's a set of lips. And the last thing was this really cute um, ice cream bubble. I thought that was cute and fun. Perfect to put in the Easter basket as well. Alright guys, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed my Dollar Tree haul video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you again for watching.